Okay, so this is the first trap. And I think that, I think that's evidence that a dung beetle might be in this trap. So here's hoping. We lift the dung pile off. <gasps> oh yes! And look, there's one, two, at least two door dung beetles in here. Up oh, three, four. Hey, loads of door dung beetles. Okay, I've got my bucket with a lid that has holes in it. I'm gonna put some manure in that. But first, I'm going to put a little bit of this straw so that as I'm putting the door dung beetles in, they can't fly out. So, Hopefully we'll have lots of door dung beetles. And this is the first trap. I still have two more traps to go over there. Oh, it's so exciting. I have a good population of door dung beetles. Let's see. <gasps> Loads of them. Look at that. <gasps> this is so fantastic. Look at all of them. Oh, wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Cool, seriously cool. So excited by so many dung beetles. I am doing the right thing. Yay! Okay, I'm gonna put these into the bucket and put the lid on and go and see what I have at the next, in the next uh, trap. Oh, these guys, come on. There's one. See, you know what? I could almost just lift. No, it's it's hard. There's so many of them. And I want to be gentle. Come here. Oh, look, there's another. That's a miniature small dung beetle. Not a miniature door dung beetle. That's a different kind of dung beetle. Come here. There. Oh, so many of them. This is so exciting. So exciting. Oops, come here. In amongst the straw. And then they play dead. That's the funny part, is they also play dead. Okay, now put the lid on and I'm gonna give them some manure, fresh manure. Now, here, this is another kind of dung beetle. This is not a door dung beetle and I can't pick it up with my fingers, my fingers in gloves. Ah. I'll have to, come here, come here. Ah, oh, nope. Oh, come here. Oh, this is not, there we go. I got it, okay. I'm gonna put it in the, this bin as well. There we go. That is so cool from only one trap. Now, if the rest of the traps are like that, that is gonna be a magnificent haul. And thank you to your manure ladies. Well done. Now to the next trap. My bucket to collect more fresh manure to give to, so far the beetles in there, puppy's gone off. Um, so this is trap number two, and it looks like somebody went in there, and somebody went in there, and somebody might have gone in there. So we might have a goodly number of dung beetles in this trap as well. Inca's anticipating, let's see. Okay, lots of flies. And yes, dung beetles again. Let's see. Look, at, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <gasps> Loads! Wow! Serious dung beetle harvest happening here. It just, and I think we might have a second kind of dung beetle. There's different size dung beetles that we have in Ireland. That's one. And then if you look at this one, oh, come here, 
Come here, I can pick you up. Okay, those are two different dung, door dung beetles. You can see the size differences. So those are two different species of door dung beetle that we have here in Ireland. So that means that we have three different ones here on our farm because there's another big one that we had last year. So, okay, I've got to empty these into this bucket. I think the film crew is gonna be very, look at this, is heaving with dung beetles. Look at them all. Wow, this is so cool. So cool. Inca's excited too. Loads of door dung beetles. Okay, I've got to uh, start picking these out and putting them into my bucket. <gasps> I might have like 30 or 40 in no time. Yay! So cool. And two different species at least. Isn't that right, Inca? Very exciting. And this is only trap number two. I have a third trap to go. <laughs> My little beginner entomologist whoop, gone off to chase something else. And the experienced entomologist Okay, so let's see. Again, there, there, and there look like entrances made by dung beetles. And lo and behold, there are dung beetles. Look at that. They are just so amazing. These guys are so important to biodiversity and soil health. And if you have a healthy population of dung beetles, you have a good environment for so many other birds and bats and all kinds of hedgehogs, badgers. Look at these. So there's two different kinds of dung beetles right there. Let me see if I can get these. Oop, I've got too many. Okay. I had such a lovely complaint having too many. Now, let's see, I have to shake the bucket so that they don't take flight and start putting them in. Shake this out, put this to the side and start collecting them up. Now there's two different ones, two different kinds, a big one and a small one. another one. There's loads of them. It's easier to pick them up with my bare hands than the glove. So I'm afraid. You know what? I don't really care. Look at these. So many of them. So many of them. Oh wow. The place is heaving with them. You can hear them starting to fly in there. So I've got to, whoops, you're not gonna get out. Okay. Now I think, I think I've gotten all the dung beetles out. Yep, all the dung beetles are out. Return this in. This is to prevent them from taking off and flying up out of the box. So there we go. Now to get a, some, a big pile of fresh manure from over there to put in there so they have food for all day. And then I'll give them another fresh manure tonight because you have to look after them. You have to feed them. So they have oxygen. You can see the air holes. And um, now I have to go get them some food. But let's just have a gl gl glance at how many I've got. Look at that. Look, that one's about to try and fly. So, Fox is heaving with them. Look at that. Oh, I'd say there's 30 or 40 dung beetles. Plenty for a film crew to take multiple takes and make mistakes. And this shows that we have a really good, healthy dung beetle population. Oh, that's so exciting! Yay! Okay, now to go and collect them their food.
think it's fascinated by the noise coming from the box now, or the bucket. Can you hear that noise? That's all those dung beetles starting to munch and get into the manure. Oh, that's so cool. You can hear them. They're all climbing up into the manure and starting to eat. This will end up being a really finely chewed up, excellent fertilizer for plants at the end of it. But I'm gonna give them fresh manure tomorrow, uh, sorry, this evening. And I'll put, when I put fresh manure on top of these. So, yeah, no, things are looking good. I think we have a really good, I don't wanna, my, I've got shitty hands to gloves. So I'm making a shitty dog. Ooh. Okay, so first dung beetle trapping. I haven't counted the dung beetles. There could easily be 30 to 40 in this bucket. So that is so fantastic. In from just three small traps, one, two, three. And uh, oh, that is just brilliant news at how many dung beetles we have here on the farm. That only three traps and I got easily 30 to 40 dung beetles, easily. I'll have to count them at some stage, but not right now. They're too excited getting some food. Anyway, okay, job done.